Hi and hello everyone, I'm Aina. So welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you guys are new to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Okay, so actually I know the Chuba bought uh, this video a few days ago, tapi tak jadi sebab hujan ribut. So so like a lot of noise construction. So I tak dapat nak buat video tu. And now actually I'm just nak pergi kedai to buy few things. But then I trust nak buat video. So yeah. Ding 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 ding. Okay, so I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know why. So please bear with me in this video because I don't want to cut any like anything. I mean, not just upload je this video without have so many things to be ed not edit so many things. So please bear with me. So everyone, um, as you guys know from my previous video, can I tengah mencari uh, like serum, good serum for me to try. So many of my friends and juga uh, comments in the video yang suggest me to try Zarzu serum. So yeah, I have tried Sarzo Serum. So today's video is about my feedback or my journey or my anything lah regarding Sarzo Serum. I have used Sarzo Serum ni for a month but there's something behind my experience uh, there's something behind this so stay tuned watch till the end okay first thing first i'm gonna talk about the packaging so uh i use kesangat dengan packaging dia for me it's so fancy sebab kotak dia macam ni tau so fancy buka macam ni ha, so fancy like uh, other serum yang I nak pernah tengok lah uh, kotak dia orang tu just like buka atas macam ni kan ha. lepas tu korang boleh buang kotak dia kotak ni ni so fancy tapi I nak simpan kotak dia tapi I simpan just to share just to tunjuk kepada korang uh, tak boleh simpan walaupun dia cantik eh, tak boleh nak simpan lah nanti semak lah kan bilik I so Okay, like I told you guys, I suka sangat dengan dia punya packaging, so fancy. Buka macam ni, huh? Thank you card, fancy kan? Lepas so, adalah serum dia sekali dengan sponge. So that the serum won't macam... So that the serum will fit nicely into the box. Okay. So they got that's mine. Okay, botol dia pula. Botol dia ni, I rasa kaca. Kau boleh tengok tak? Kaca kot. I don't know. Uh, kalau nak guna, korang just buka. Macam ni. Kena basah. Nervous sangat nak buat video kat korang. So basah tangan I. Oh, so korang just buka macam ni. And titik-titikkan lah dia. Hmm, kat buka korang. Like. Hmm, like that. So serum dia macam ni lah. Macam ni lah. Serum ni, botol ni. Uh, uh, Kalau you guys tanya, I, I suka botol dia Sebab I boleh main-main I boleh main-main, I rasa macam wow, I tengah buat eksperimen I suka sangat Tapi the uh, Cons dia adalah Like Boleh jatuh lah kot, kan? Tak pun penutup dia boleh hilang ke? Kali korang buat-buat-buat kan? Terjatuh, hilang hmm. Entahlah Entahlah Kons dia macam tu lah kot Kons dia ni Kons dia Kalau korang pakai Rasa tiba ni letak atas meja Tiba siku korang terlanggar kan Pak benda tu pecah Sia-sia je Habis duit ni pergi Itu hmm. je lah kons dia kot ha. uh, Next uh, Harga dia uh, Actually I nak beli serum ni Time tengah sale 
uh, since ramai yang suggest and then macam oh patut tak beli patut tak beli patut tak beli lepas tu macam kawan ni pula ajak kan so i beli lah i bought this 30ml serum for 49 ringgit i rasa normal price dia adalah 59 ringgit so for the texture i suka I suka texture dia. Sekejap eh. Ini dekat korang. Sekejap. I boleh membazir lah sebab I tak pakai dia sekarang. Hmm, nak tahu nak nampak. Sekejap lagi. <laughs> so texture dia. Uh, Sekejap eh. Alamak. So texture dia. Dia. Alamak. Dia not so thick. I suka sangat. I suka. Suka gila dengan texture dia. Not so thick. So bila korang pakai dekat muka korang. Dia tak. Sticky sangat lah no, Tak sticky Sangat Macam hmm. okay. ni Masih pula pakai tangan je uh, Colorless And tak ada bau Tak ada bau apa-apa pun Bau chemical ke bukan? No, no, no. Tak ada tak ada Tak ada bau apa-apa pun um, And Okay uh, This serum claims Yang uh, it helps to fit your scars To brighten your face uh, dia, um, Macam tu lah kuat Rasanya dia, dia uh, Benefit serum ni Mesti you guys Kalau you guys pernah tengok video Aina Mesti you guys tanya kan Kenapa Aina beli? Benefit dia sama je macam uh, Cayman Essence yang Aina pakai tu kan So why did you buy Why did you buy this kind? Okay, kenapa? Sebab actually I macam nak complete kan Aina punya skincare routine Yang ada macam essence kan, clean, uh, cleanser, essence, serum, eye cream, blah 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 I nak complete kan that one, so I need to have the serum Walaupun I tahu function dia sama kan Betul ke tak? Betul ke decision I macam tu? Tak betul lah kan? Tapi I beli juga lah, untuk I try juga I, I uh, at this moment, I try to find the best skincare for my skin. So, I try this one lah. Like I told you guys, I na suka the packaging. I na suka the bottle, the packaging bottle dia, the packaging yang dua apa I na suka. Uh, the price for me affordable, uh, murah lah juga kan. Uh, boleh lah. Murah lah juga. Kalau beli time sale, lagi lah murah kan. Bila 50 je. Uh, lepas tu, uh, I nak suka the texture. Odorless. Colorless. Uh, not too thick. And not sticky. I suka. Uh, function, kalau I tak pakai Cayman Essence tu, probably I like the function lah. Uh, tapi... Oh, pasal function dia macam ni. Is it working to my face? Is it working? Is it jadi ketakkan kat muka Aina? Uh, like, I'm not sure. <laughs> I really not. I tak sure. Sebab all of the scars on my face memang susah gila nak fade. I don't know why. Susah gila nak hilang. I don't know why. And betul lah I pakai Cayman Essence Function dia sama So I cannot tell I really cannot tell Sama ada Cayman Eh uh, Cayman The Zara Su Serum ni Menjadi ke Tak menjadi Cerita dia Okay cerita dia uh, Aina dah pakai Zara Su Serum ni For a month Ada lagi Oh 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 uh, uh. Sorry, I have to go back to the packaging. Okay, uh, cons dia adalah dia opak. So, korang tak, tak boleh nak tengok content dalam dia. So, kita tak boleh nak tahu lah dah habis ke, belum habis ke. I thought dia macam dengan mata kasar ni je tak nampak. So, kena fikir cahaya macam tu kan. Tapi sebenarnya tak. Memang tak boleh juga tengok. I tak tahu lah diorang dah upgrade ke tak diorang punya botol ni, packaging ni. Boleh tengok ke? I tak tahu lah. Okay, back to our story. I dah pakai ini for a month. Still, I tak tahu lah banyak ke sikit macam I told you guys. I cannot see the content kan. So, I tak tahu banyak ke lagi ke tak ke. Uh, yeah, I already pakai for a month lah. And I tak tahu satu botol ni boleh last for how many months. 
um, if you guys tengok I punya previous video pasal Cayman Serum, like I told you guys, um, after I pakai Cayman Serum tu, I started to have those like tiny bumps on my face, on my cheeks. So, bila I pakai Zarzu Serum, uh, those tiny bumps, they are still there, but uh, less visible and uh, less lah. Tak banyak sangat macam mula-mula uh, dia start dulu. Okay. Tapi, still there lah. Still there. So, I macam, why ah? And people macam orang sekeliling I start to tegur tau. Previously, dia tak tegur. Tapi, I tak tahulah kenapa kan. Dia dah start tegur. Dia macam, eh kenapa adik-adik I kan? Macam, eh kenapa muka Kak Nga macam, macam, tu lah macam ada tak rata lah macam tu. Lepas tu, even, Ya, ramai lah ramai orang yang rapat-rapat dengan I Tegur kan So Jadi macam risau Macam macam mana Macam mana Kan tak sesuai juga kan dengan benda ni Macam macam mana So I stop this I stop using Zarzu Serum For a week Already Ke dah? Dah lebih, dah lebih seminggu dah hmm. And then I had an appointment dengan dermatologist. Uh, it's actually for my uh, hair sebab ini ada uh, masalah rambut. Tapi alang-alang kan? So, I nak tanya lah pasal ini punya tiny bumps. So, um, he asked me to stop using the product that I think uh, menyebabkan Aina punya tiny bumps dulu ada So Dia suruh I stop use that I said already Masa Aina jumpa tu dah Dah lebih kurang Almost lah Almost a week already hmm. Lepas tu Dia bagi Aina uh, Ubat Cleanser It's actually cleanser I tak tahu benda I mean like I, I tak tahu tu actually ubat apa, cleanser apa sebab dia, dia bagi dalam botol merah macam tu so I use the cleanser and I tak tahulah kulit muka I tak sesuai ke apa dengan cleanser tu I tak tahu apa penyebabnya I tak tahu um, either Zazu Serum, bila I stop Zazu Serum ni, tu lah penyebabnya I dapat breakups ni ataupun sebabkan I start Use the cleanser Menyebabkan breakup ni So, I tak tahulah yang mana Tapi yang pastinya, I sekarang dah ada breakouts uh, Apa? Those tiny bumps Dia start jadi acne yang besar-besar tau Sekarang ni, I tak pakai makeup apa-apa Kecuali uh, Skincare And lipstick So Nampak lagi kan ha? Ni ni Nampak tak? Hmm, nampak kan? Ni Ada lor Of Those uh, Acne yang besar-besar yang I cakap kat you guys tu Yang arise from the tiny bumps Hmm Dah siap kan? Sini lah, sini You guys see that? So big It's so big So painful And so itchy Hmm, banyak sini hmm. banyak lah yang pastinya so oh sebab kain yang so takut I tak tahu which one cause my breakup I tak tahu sama ada I tak sesuai dengan cleanser yang doktor tu bagi ke Ataupun disebabkan I dah stop kit Apa? Zarzu Serum ni ke? Ataupun disebabkan oleh rentetan daripada penggunaan Zarzu Serum ni ke? I don't know, I don't know which one I tak menyalahkan apa-apa pun Eh, I don't know which one So, I stop both I stop Zarzu I stop uh, Ubat doktor tu juga 
uh, and I use Tafil lah as my pencil I use Tafil sebab Anna punya previous breakout pun I guna Tafil as my pencil so I think it would be fine for me now to use the pencil sebenarnya macam ni um, bukan sebab this room tak bagus no uh, I tak cakap dia tak bagus probably because my skin yang tak sesuai dengan macam mana? my skin yang tak fit dengan serum tu or tak suit dengan serum tu bukan because that serum tak bagus why? sebab ramai je yang bagi feedback serum tu bagus kalau tak yang tak beli dah okay. uh, ramai je bagi feedback serum tu bagus so that's not the serum fault cause me break up because it's it is because of my skin yang tak sesuai dengan serum tu yang ada benda yang tak sesuai dalam serum tu untuk kulit muka Aina macam tu lah kot ataupun kulit tu lah I tak tahu kan penyebab yang mana satu I don't know and uh, let me tell you guys this one thing lah it's a little advice from me uh, janganlah korang macam rasa takut untuk cuba any kind of skincare you know ni adalah okay those breakouts this breakout adalah a process for you guys to find a good products for your skin ni adalah risk yang you take okay this is the risk that I took to find a good serum for me lah so um, don't be afraid to try any of the products um, sebelum I try any products I have two things in my mind first um, the risk okay. sebab produk tu tak semestinya um, dia, dia baik untuk orang lain baik juga untuk Aina macam tak semestinya it works well on others it will work well on me so uh, that one thing on my mind lah so the risk that I'll be taking is breakouts so I have to macam mentally prepared lah kalau ada breakouts because of that product second uh, tak semestinya breakout tu cause by that product tak bagus faham tak it probably because you yourself macam your skin yang sebenarnya uh, sensitif ke apa ke that product okay je dengan others okay probably tak okay on you sebab probably you tu oh, marah tak lah tak marah <laughs> so probably uh, kita sendiri yang kulit kita sendiri yang tak boleh dengan uh, ingredients dalam produk tu so bukan salah produk hmm. it's okay to have breakouts sebab benda tu tak akan ada kat situ selama-lamanya dekat muka you all so do not worry macam along the way you akan jumpa juga product or solution to your breakouts so do not worry nanti your face akan um, kembali cantik kembali okay ataupun akan menjadi better okay so uh, don't be too stressed of the breakouts it's okay to have breakouts lah Kesimpulannya, don't afraid to try new things. Don't afraid to try Zarsu Serum. This is not a sponsored uh, review ke produk. This is not sponsored review. Okay. Don't afraid to try. Mana tahu benda ni tiba-tiba uh, kulit muka korang jadi better, lagi cantik, lagi tulus-mulus dan segala-galanya. Kan? So, tak semestinya apa yang berlaku dekat I akan bagus juga dekat korang tak semestinya benda ni tak bagus untuk I tak bagus juga untuk korang sebab so, it depends skincare ni dia depends on kulit muka korang macam mana ok uh, kalau lah kulit muka Aina tak break up kalau lah my tiny bumps um, dah hilang kalau I pakai ni this will be my favorite lah serum I nak akan setia dengannya Tapi tidak uh, I have some breakouts And my tiny bump still there 
so mm, I'll not eat the cheese. I hope you guys uh, love this review video, this feedback video thing. Uh, if you guys have any tips to deal with breakouts, please comment down below. And that's all for today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you guys have any comments for me macam to improve my video, don't forget to comment down below. Um, till we meet again, please pray for my skin to get better soon. Tolong doakan supaya kulit muka Ina um, pulih dengan segera. Okay? And I also doakan supaya korang dapat kulit yang korang idamkan, yang flawless, yang bright dan sebagainya. Till we meet again! Bye-bye!